A very warm welcome to all viewers. Now we're gonna see about top 5 soil erosion fighting plants. In this video, we're gonna see about their botanical names and their common names, their botanical classification and the reason of their soil holding capacity. Number 1. Juniper is Alexandrilius. They are commonly called as creeping jumper. And now we are going to see about their botanical classification. By the way, what is botanical classification? Botanical classification means the science of naming the organism and placing them in a hierarchy structure, each cell being given name and it's used to identify the plant or animal characteristic features. Now we are going to see about their botanical classification. They come under eukaryotic, kingdom plantae, clad tracheophytes. Tracheophytes means they are vascular bearing plants. And division Pinophyta. Pinophyta means the leaves are needle like structure and order Pinaleas, family Carpaceae and genus Juniper and species Harisondyles. And the reason of their water holding capacity is they are rapidly spreading plants and it has high soil holding capacity so that it is very virulent to soil erosion. Number 2. Munica Miners. They are commonly called as Creeping Mitchell because they are creeping plants. Now we are going to see about their botanical classification. Domain. They come under Eukaryotic which means they have two nucleus, Kingdom. Plantae. Clad. Tracheophytes. As we said earlier, Tracheophytes means vascular bearing plants. Order. Gelatinous. Gelatinous means they consist of gel. In this picture, you can see the leaves with green shining color. The shininess is due to the presence of gelatinous. And family, Apophyceus. Apophyceus means flower bearing plant. And genus, Vinica species minor. And the reason of the soil holding capacity is they are vastly spreading plants. It has high soil holding capacity due to which they prevent soil erosion. Number 3. Forestrica europea. They are commonly called as Forestrica and their botanical classification domain they come under eukaryotic, kingdom, plantae, clad, tracheophytes. You know already what is tracheophytes and order Laminaleus. Laminaleus means they have dichotomous flower, family Oleaceus, genus Forsythia and species Europea. And reason of their water holding capacity is they are vastly spreading plants. You can see these plants in hilly region. It has high soil holding capacity and it will reduce the runoff water in the hilly region. Number 4. Pakchisenda terminalis. They are commonly called as Japanese super age because these plants are mostly found in Japan. Now we are going to see about their botanical classification. Domain, they come under eukaryotic, kingdom, plantae, clad, tracheophytes, order, bacillus, and family, bacillaceus. Bacillaceus means the male and female flowers are separate in this plant. Genus, Pactisentra species, terminalis. Reason of this all learning capacity, it is fa fastly spreading plant. It has the capacity to bind the soil and virulent to soil erosion. Now we have reached the last plant of this video. Number 5. Laminale Metallium. They are commonly called as spot dead needles because they are very poisonous plant. And we are going to see about their botanical classification. Domain. Eukaryotic, Kingdom, Plantae, Clad, Tracheophytes, or the Laminales. Namelus means they are dichotinous flower. Family Laminaleus, genus Laminium, species Macalitum. And reason of their soil holding capacity. It is fast spreading plant and it absorbs running water due to which we can prevent the soil erosion by planting this plant. Number 4. Pakchisenda terminalis. They are commonly called as Japanese Super Age 
because these plants are mostly found in Japan. Now we're gonna see about their botanical classification. Domain: they come under eukaryotic kingdom, plantae, clad, trachyophytes, order Bacillus, and family Bacillaceus. Bacillaceus means the male and female flowers are separate in this plant. Genus: Pachycentra species, Terminalis. Reason of this all learning capacity: it's a fastly spreading plant. It has the capacity to bind the soil and virulent to soil erosion. Want to know more about these topics? Please follow us on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, and don't forget to subscribe our channel.